October is our own Bible study month, and we are ready to encounter Christ even as we come, connect, grow, and blossom. Live from Sitam Kisumu, these are our announcements. Safari Encounter Stage is here with us. All those who went through the enter stage are kindly requested to attend seven sessions offered in this stage as well as the Bible study sessions. Encounter stage kicks off on the 11th of October to the 29th of November 2015. This is an encounter with God. Do not miss. The next New Believers or the Safari Enter Stage begins next Sunday on the 11th of October at the Multipurpose Hall from 8.30 to 10 a.m. This class is for those people who got saved recently and have not been attending the New Believers teachings. Come one, come all. You've seen it, you've loved it, you've supported it, and now the announcement crew is looking for you. Yes, you. Are you born again, man or woman of character, mature in the faith, talented or gifted, available? If you have any of the above qualities, kindly visit the sound desk at the balcony after the service. Remember, 1 Peter chapter 4, verse 10, as every man has received the gift, even so ministers the same, one to another, as good stewards of the manifold grace of God. All parents with children aged 1 to 12 are invited for a parenting workshop that will take place on the 10th of October 2015. This will happen in the CETA Multipurpose Hall from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. The theme, Transforming Character. Speakers, Mr. and Mrs. Masinde, Mr. and Mrs. Kokumu, Mr. and Mrs. Omoto. Come and come with a friend. This workshop is only for parents and not children. We would like to appreciate Sitam Kisumu staff, the church leadership, pastoral team, together with the host who took part in the Afleo ministry. Marriage is a gift from God and a holy institution. The question is, why do marriages fail? The high rate of divorce and separation among the Christian couples. The excitement, kisses, smiles, dancing, and celebration that we see on the wedding day. Turns to sorrow and pain and bitterness. Why does this happen? How can we overcome it? Find out more by registering for premarital classes if you plan to wed in Sitam Kisumu come the year 2016 between the period of the month of April to December. Registration fee is 2,500 Kenya shillings. The classes will commence on the second week of January 2016 in class 7 after the first service. For more information, contact the deputy senior pastor. Amen. <laughs> Bible Study Fellowship, BSL, resumes this month with a study on the book of Revelation. This will take place on Thursday, the 8th of October, 2015, in the Visitor's Lounge, from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. All ladies are welcome. All the men are welcome to the men's retreat that will take place on 16th of October to the 17th of October. This will happen at the Salia Retreat Center in Muhoroni from 5.30 on Friday to Saturday 3 p.m. The charges are 1,000 Kenya shillings. Register at the information desk after the service. My name is Susan Mukiri. I'm born again. I fellowship at Mirimani Bible Study. Uh, since I joined the Bible Study, my life has never been the same again. One thing, I've come to know the scriptures. I can relate with the scriptures, and I'm so glad that the brethren are so friendly. Recently, I lost my mom, and I'm telling you these people, they came in numbers. They even gave uh, a pastor, uh, gave me a pastor to go with me all the way to Kiambu. I've seen the love of, of brethren in this church. I welcome people to join the Bible study or from where you come from. Be welcome, and you will be blessed. <laughs> Thank you. 
Christ is the Answer Ministries Children's Rehabilitation Center is located on 56 acres in Oloi Loiti, Koshi, 17 kilometers from Kisarian Town. The center is home and school for street children, 90% from the city of Nairobi and 10% from Kadiado and its environs. Every year, the center's social worker will scout out and vet 25 to 30 children between the ages of 6 and 8 from the streets and city slums of Nairobi, looking out for children from communities where they are likely to be forced into early marriages or are prone to abuse or even crime. I came to sit up Kisarian in 2005. I used to be a street child begging and fortunately during I think it was in mid-2005 my mom got to know the then social worker and the social worker took us. We was a group so that's how we came to sit up Kisarian. The children are assured of food, shelter, medical care and education up to tertiary and university level, so they can take care of themselves and others after they leave the support of the center. The children are grounded in prayer. They learn from the Word of God and they are counseled on how to deal with the life they left on the streets and thus transformed into God-fearing, spirit-filled adults who can impact their families and their communities. After finishing my class five, there was a member from Sitam Karen who wanted to sponsor to sponsor two children from here. And I was one of the fortunate children who are who are sponsored into our school. And I ended up scoring 404 in my KCCP. I joined St. Jesus Girls Secondary School. I scored an A of 81 points and I joined Igaton University and I'm currently doing a children's science. Currently, the center is home to 87 children. It sponsors 37 children to local primary boarding schools, 43 children to local secondary schools, five children go to tertiary colleges, and four are now students at Kenyan universities. Working with the very needy, the poorest of the poor, is usually, um, it's not an investment in terms of money. You spend millions of shillings, but you may not necessarily have any returns in monetary form. But then speaking of the love of Jesus, there's a big price paid for us to reach out to those who cannot find help anywhere. So our biggest impact is to actually live out our mission that Christ is the answer. If I hadn't come to Sitam Kisarian, right now I think I could have been somewhere in a village or still in a slum, maybe married, like the other girls who were left there. But then God, because when I came here, I was enlightened and I got to know the importance of education. And that's why I'm this far, I'm still doing well compared to other people who I left behind. I was a very rude girl and I was always, every time I was in cases, every time people were hating me and now I'm, I'm a changed girl. I came here in Sunday in 2009, I got saved in 2009. Now I know Jesus Christ is my personal savior. I thank God because he has brought me in center because when I came I was very thin, but now I'm very fat. I thank God for it because he has brought me so that I can be helped and get education. For more information, visit our website, kisumu.sitam.org. You can get audio, video, word sermon on our Facebook page, Sitam Kisumu Church. Follow us on Twitter, at Sitam Kisumu. Sitam Kisumu type and offering and PESA pay bill number is 933-946. Sitam Kisumu, where we are committed to excellence.